Not too long ago, Zumbinis enjoyed the good life. Though they all looked slightly different, different eyes, noses, hair, feet, such differences meant nothing to the Zumbinis. And so they lived happily on Zumbini Isle, making small useful products which were prized the world over. The Zumbinis had a sense of fulfillment and inner peace, not to mention healthy bank accounts. Then one day, who should show up but the bloke? The bloats offered to help the Zumbinis grow their businesses, expand their trade routes, and improve their quality of life. Being trusting sorts, the Zumbinis agreed. But before long, the bloats had taken over everything. Stealing profits, canceling holidays, piling on work. The Zumbinis were getting pretty stressed out. Well, you can push them only so far before they take matters into their own hands. Uh, so to speak. So they decided to escape and build a new home in a distant land. Good day, class. My name is Professor Adventure, and welcome to Zoom Beanies. I know a lot of you have been waiting for a while for this game on uh, my channel so here we are and today I have a special guest you might recognize him from our nightlight playthrough and our reader rabbit uh, playthrough way way back so please help me in welcoming you're expecting me to introduce myself here <laughs> yes I was kind of hoping for you to just pick that up Right, right. As I, I, don't, I don't remember what I was called before you, you were bio rules I'm you the bio rules you want to do you want to change it I'll stick with the bio. All right, rules. welcome, bio rules. Let's give them hey. a round of applause, everybody. Yes, yes. Okay, so here we are. You guys just finished the intro with us, so let us enter our name. I hope. Yeah, there I'm we go. I'm excited about this game. This is a game that uh, one of my friends had when I was younger, and I desperately wanted it when I was young and could never find it. And now, 15 years later, here it is. Here it is on S Steam. It was. Yeah, you got this right. So. Yeah, guys, definitely check this out. Um, what is our name going to be? That's a good question. Mm. All right, I'm going to use my left finger, and you're going to use your right finger. Oh, God. And we're <laughs> going to just hit three keys, and that'll be our name. So I'm going to go D, J, T, O, P. Jigtop. Jigtop. We're Jigtop. Jigtop it is. All right, start. So I've never played this game. I know some things about this game. So... To begin with, we are choosing the Zumbinis who are coming on the adventure with us. Okay. So you can pick one hair, one eyes, one nose, and one feet. Ugh. Okay, well, we're going to we're gonna work on this as a collaborative effort, so I'm going to start off by choosing our hair. Um, I kind of want to do ball cap. Okay. So uh, that's for me. I mm, like glasses. I like the glasses. I'm going to go for the... Blue nose, cause I like blue. Uh, and I'm gonna go with the rolling feet. Rolling feet. This will be Yaska. Yaska. All right. Excellent. Oh, he's cute. And now we gotta do that 19 more times. What? We have. We take 20 Zumbinis with us on the first journey. Oh, my. I believe. Now, uh, there are two extra buttons down there. There is a single dice that will randomize one Zumbini, and there's multi-dice which will randomize the entire journey to save a bit of time if we want to. Oh, okay. Do we? Can we use that random dice at any point? Yep. All right, um, so I'm going to choose the next Zumbini, you're going to choose the next Zumbini, and then we're going to randomize the rest of them. Okay, and we do want to bring variety. Variety. So I'm going to go for you. 
uh, little dotty eyes, yellow nose, and shoes. That'll be my Zubini. Obuto. Skates. Mr. Skate Man. Uh, I'm going to pick the square hair and single eye and green nose and the spring. All right. For Akura. Akura. And then we're just gonna we're gonna randomize up the rest of them. Here they come. Ah, oh, look at them. They're so cute. So we got to keep these guys through the entire journey. Is that the uh, the goal here? For the most part, if we lose a few, there's areas that we'll be able to build them up again. Well, I say that. You'll be sending more. Okay. They're they're a little lemming-like. I've never played this game, so this is this is very quite exciting for me. Okay, so that crew. is our crew. Some of them look uh, pretty similar, but that should be okay. We got a lot of hats on our crew. We do have a lot of hats that could be problematic. Could that be problematic there? All right, well, we're just going to go with it. So play button, I'm, I'm assuming? I assume so. And off they go. A little think... jingle and away we go. After days tossed about by a stormy sea, the Zumbinis reach the shore of a peculiar land. Oh, what peculiar land have we seen? It looks like spaceships are on the ground. It certainly does. There was a stone that looked like a Zumbini. Oh, I love the artwork in this game. Okay, so... so... If I remember correctly, or do I not spoil this for you? Uh, I mean, it looks like, what am I, I have to cross a bridge, obviously. Yeah. So I've got all these pegs here. Do I click on, so I click on like a zoom beanie, and I line them up on whichever bridge I want them to line them up on. Yep. So. <laughs> oh. So he can't take that bridge. There is something about him that is not okay for that bridge. Okay. I like it. Do I... Can I take the... Okay, so those pegs don't do the, the pegs are how many okay, attempts we so, get before the whole thing falls. Got it. So I'm gonna pick something that's... <clears throat> we should find someone who is absolutely nothing like him and send him across the bridge he just tried to do. Well, someone... No, that's got wheels. Mm -hmm. Let's try this one. Uh, yeah, he's got a different hair, different... Actually, that's nose. your guy, so... That is my guy. There we go. Be... So, that bridge also can't have something that he's got. Okay, so... Hmm. So, we only have two people with the regular glasses. Right. Uh, so... We have this one at the bottom who is exactly like the one at the top, except she's got a different hat. Mm -hmm. I would send her down the bottom. This one down the bottom? I think so. Okay. I think that's our best chance to get someone across. Uh, hey! Okay, so I thought it was going to be one different one for each bridge, right? Uh, I'm, I'm not 100% sure. I'm assuming each one can only go across one bridge. There's... Okay. So... Uh... Okay, so glasses, hat... Shoes and blue nose could go across this bottom bridge. Yeah. So those are all acceptable for the bottom. Um, figuring out who should go. Mm -hmm. So we have one more glasses girl. We do. With the hair and the feet. Right. So let me think here for a minute. Because we put both of those two along the top, right? They're the ones that... Yeah. They went on the, along the top. They couldn't make it. Yeah. So... The only similarity that she has to either of them is the glasses. So it's possible the glasses would be okay on the top. I, I think that's worth trying. All right, let's give that a try. Hey, it works. Okay. 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 And it looks like it's going to keep them on the sides that, that they successfully that went. That they go on. Okay. So if it wasn't clear... The game is about learning logic. Mm. So we have to logically figure out who is going to be able to go on each bridge. Okay, so if these two weren't able to cross this bridge, they'll be able to cross this bottom bridge. Yes. Okay. We're just kind of using them as kind of the reference point. Yeah. So it would stand to reason that there's... Um, so, yeah. If, if we grab somebody like this going across the top bridge just to see if they would make it... Yeah, then we'll know if the hat is a problem, I guess, or the roller skates. Yeah. Now, the roller skates should be fine, because we sent someone with roller skates. Right. 
The rest is questionable. The rest is questionable. So let's try that. Okay, that was a problem. So that's a problem. I'm thinking it's possible that the green noses cannot go on the top. Okay. So we won't send any more green noses up there. And those ones who are stuck at the top, I'm pretty sure you can send them on the other bridge. Right. But I'm just going to leave them there just, just so we know. Just so we know. Okay. Just so we can remember. <coughs> so, okay. So. So, so, so. So we have this other guy with the green nose on the left. This guy. Yeah. So let's send him on the bottom. See if that works. Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. So I'm getting the feeling that most of our green noses are going to be going across the bottom. Yeah. I'd send the other. We have one more with a green nose. This one. Yeah. All right. Oh, I hear Ooh. creaking. Scary okay. stuff. All these stones have little faces on them. It's kind of creepy. Um, yeah, okay. So my next supposition. Yes. Is we've sent a green nose and a blue nose on the bottom and a yellow nose on the top. Mm. So maybe we stick with that pattern for now because we tried to send green and blue across the top and they couldn't go. So if we tried this guy on the top where yeah. we got little hair and then skates. Yeah. Yes. So I think it's the noses. I think All that's right. the problem. All right. So let's let's go this other yellow one that's very similar off the top. Mm -hmm. I believe this area is known as the allergic cliffs. Hmm. Or something along those lines. The thing we don't know about is pink and red nose. Yeah. That'll be interesting. That'll be interesting. I mean, we still got two tries here. So yeah. Or maybe we'll try. Changes. Maybe we'll try pink on top. Okay. <laughs> no. no. So pinks are going to go across the bottom. Yeah. Assuming that it was actually the pink and not something else. But I'm not sure what else it could be. Yeah. Okay. So, I mean, these guys are like sneezing every time they go yeah. across, right? So that's kind of a hint right there. I would. So my next suggestion is we get as many across as we can before we run out of tries. Mm, I like that thought. So all these guys are going on the bottom. Because to start sending them across. <coughs> yeah, because if any of them, uh, if any of them can't make it, they'll have to go back to the island. Ugh, we can't have that. And oh, they're so happy for their friends. Okay, so if we send this blue nose down the bottom, we should be okay. Yeah. And if we send this yellow off the top, that should be good. And the pink along the bottom and the two blues along the bottom. The pink and the two blues along the bottom. Ah, oh, they gotta wait for one another to cross. Mm -hmm. Taking their time. It's a rickety bridge, a long fall. So, we do have, I think, two attempts for this last one. Mm -hmm. I would say try the top first, because it's got less people on it. Ah! Uh, for the red nose. It or... might be that yellow's are only allowed to cross mm. that and all the other colors are going on the bottom so i'm going to try red on the bottom okay it seems reasonable and you were right and i was it. right there Very we nice. go <laughs> Whoa, man, you've done exceptionally well hey, thank carry you carry on carry on alabaster i don't know who's talking to us i don't know either but i kind of like that voice acting And then we just go on to the next puzzle, eh? These yep. stone gods have their rules, so do proceed with skill. Zumbini's one god won't allow, the other god surely will. Okay, kind of the similar thing that we just did with the bridges. He may have been talking about the bridges. Mm. Here we go oh. again. Welcome! So... Hmm... So, if I recall... Uh, you've got four guards here. You got the two gray and the two green, and each one blocks one of the caves. Right. So you have to put people through where, like, into the caves that are acceptable. Something okay. like that. Okay. Do they give me any hints if I click on them? They do not. No. We have to experiment and see what happens. Okay. Well, we've got a bunch of green caps, so we might as well try that first. Okay. Uh, let's try you first then, I guess. Off the top left path. Ooh, so she Sorry. can't go that way. Okay. Do so we want to figure out where she goes first? Instead of trying to send up just one path? I guess there's no real... 
because it doesn't look like... Yeah, I guess so, because it doesn't look like there's any negatives for, like, mm -hmm. them not making it like the bridge was going to be, right? Yeah, so far. So let's try the next battle. Can't do that either. Nope. Oh, you know what? Mm -hmm. Because both of those pathways went past the green guy. So something about her can't go past that green guy whatsoever. Oh, okay. So she, so she has to go on one of these other two. So pathways. she's gonna be over here somewhere. Yeah. Okay. That's cool how you can like just kind of stack them and mm -hmm. put them in different spots. Like I can just put her down there, which works. So there we you go. go. That was in. that was complete accident. I did yeah. that. <laughs> so okay. So she got past both the guy on the right and the person on the top. Mm hmm. Um. We have more baseball caps and sunglasses. We could try sending that same way. Sure, let's try that. Well, you're okay. Do go in. Okay, looks like uh, base. It might just be the baseball caps are allowed that way. Could be. We'll have to let's just try baseball idea. caps and regular glasses. Huh? Mm -hmm. Looks good. Looks good. Yes, very good. So that's good. Um, I guess we'll try... Should we just try all the baseball caps? Yeah, I like that thought. Eh. Yeah, yes, you're alright. Go on ahead. Go get the candy at the end of the cave. There is no candy kids. Oh. Alright, we're just going to put all our green hats up there. Oh, they're so happy for each other. Mm -hmm. I'm so happy for them. One of the chosen few. Hurrah. <laughs> One of the few, but All right, have so what are we going to do after the green caps? Proceed. Well, that's a question. I don't remember what blocked on the left side other than the green okay, caps. Okay, so... Uh, yeah, she's at the back and I can't... Oh, I can grab her. Okay, so she had green nose, glasses, and rollers. Yeah. So, it was uh. possibly the hat was the problem. Mm, just the hair in general. So we have three that have sh four that have shaggy hair. Mm-hmm. So maybe we should try sending shaggy hairs around first. Okay. Let's it see. could be, for example, that the green ones look at a hair and the white ones look at something else. But I kind of feel like we sent so many up there. Yeah, it... they're all different kinds of people, right? Mm -hmm. I got a spring, <coughs> a spring here, a wheels here, shoes here, uh, more shoes. All the different noses. All the different noses and eyes. So I think... It's just the hats for this one. Okay. So we should see... Which means both of these are just judging the hats. Mm -hmm. The problem is we have five different hairstyles. Mm. Well, I guess process we'll of that. elimination. We'll have to get rid of one of them one day. Let's try sure. you here. Ah? Do go in. Ah. <laughs> all right. That's good. That's very good. All right. Let's just send all the shaggies sure. up there. That's good. Okay. That's Good. All right, so this was going to be based on the hairs. Mm -hmm. Seems like that way. <laughs> but now we have now we have three different three different ones. We got two buzzed. Mm -hmm. And we don't know if like they can pair up with any of these other ones, right? Yeah, we don't know. So I guess we'll just try. Assume that they'll have to go in different caves. So let's try him here first. Okay, by me. Ooh, not there. So he's gonna I'm have to so go. I'm so sorry. He's gonna have to go on one of the outside ones because those two inside ones can both go to that white guy. But he said it was okay here. So, so he Buzz should... is going up this way. Yeah, that should be fine. I hope. Yeah. Yeah. yeah there we go. Okay. So Buzz is okay up there. Interesting. I want to try throwing Spindle hair up this way because it might just separate. Hats only on this side and everything else on that side. Okay, that could be. Yeah, looks good. Looks good. Looks good. I like it. Aha. You yes! done quite well. Excellent. Oh yes, and then the green yeah. button. <laughs> Say hi to Arno. Who's Arno? And so our brave travelers continue on through this dusty wasteland until oh. they meet. Arno, the almost omnivorous, one very hungry pizza troll. Uh oh, we might be losing some zambanis here. Fleens? You're not fleens. 
<sighs> Whatever you are, make me a pizza! Hmm. Well, unfortunately, that's all the time we have for this episode. Mm -hmm. So, thank you all so much for watching, and stay tuned for some more Zubini action, where I'm pretty sure you want to come back for this. Oh, I do. I mean, you're going to have to, because I, gosh, I'm not going to do this on my own. No, you'd struggle. So, thank you all so much for watching. I've been Professor Adventure. I've been Bio Rules. And until next time, class is dismissed. Bye. <laughs>